Ooh, it's been a while since I did a vlog. Hey guys, it's Rich Bits here. Welcome to my newest vlog. It's been a really long time since I, I've done a vlog. So I thought I'd come on here and obviously play some guitar for you guys like we always do. I have uh, some coffee here that I made. I didn't buy it this time because I'm cheap. And I thought I'd just give you some life updates of what's been going on in my life. Some of you may notice that I've been in a different room for the past like eight or nine months. It's because I moved. So I'm just gonna come on here, play some guitar, and give you some life updates. All right, I don't really know what to play. Also, this guitar, I've been playing this guitar a lot recently. I used to not play it as much um, because it is like 20 pounds. This thing is so heavy. So it's always been kind of like a studio guitar for me. One of the life updates I'm, I was going to tell you guys about was that I started a band recently. And something that our band does is black with sparkles when we perform. It reminded me recently that I had this guitar. It's black with sparkles and I was like, hey, this is kind of like our band aesthetic. I recently bought a new strap for it, purple. Thought that might look cool. I also got a, a gel pad for it because it's so heavy and like, if I didn't have this, it would just break my shoulder um, every time I played on stage with it. So I've been breaking this guitar back in because it's it's been quite a while since I've really picked it up. I'll pick it up here and there to record stuff. I always kept it uh, drop tuned um, just because it was so heavy and I just kind of used it as fun for drop tuning rock songs pretty much. But it's a lovely guitar. It's a PRS Zach Myers SE. This is his, his first, you know, SE that he came out with probably like 10 years ago at this point. That's the Fleur de Lis here. But the really cool thing, and some people will comment about this in some of the videos that I use this guitar, is the three humbuckers. It's not every day you see a guitar with, with three humbuckers, so yeah, it's a cool guitar. Pretty versatile, sounds really cool, looks really cool. <laughs> Really cool. I really like this. It's 
It's been a pickup. I haven't really spent time really discovering all the sounds of this. So I typically just keep it on the, the bridge pickup and rock out. I am so lucky to have this and you will be seeing more of this guitar. Coffee break. Okay. Today I have, I made this latte and um, I made this with oat milk with Irish cream flavoring. So that's what we have today and it's in one of my favorite coffee cups. A guitar student of mine made this and I absolutely loved it. And speaking of students, so I am starting up, if you guys are interested, I'm starting up some virtual lessons. Um, so if you, any of you are interested in maybe taking some virtual lessons from me, head over to my Instagram at Bridget Ginhart. Just send me, shoot me a DM and say that you're interested in taking virtual lessons from me and we can set the time up and I'll let you know the price. Head over there to my Instagram if you're interested, but I'll be doing that through the summer. So please reach out if you're interested in some virtual lessons from me. Some life updates. So speaking of, of uh, Irish actually. <laughs> a good friend of mine from college, well we started a band first of all and if you saw my announcement from a, a few months back, we started a band called Queen of Peace. We recently got to play for Penn State's THON Dance Marathon. So we did that back in February. It was truly amazing because that was in the stadium there, the basketball stadium, and Penn State is my alma mater. So it was so surreal to play in the stadium that I've seen so many of my favorite artists play at. I mean, that was the biggest performance I've ever done in my life. Truly an amazing experience. And what was even cooler is we got to play one of our original songs and I'll link it maybe down below if you want to um, watch that performance. It was for an amazing cause as well. And we've been making a lot of music recently and writing a lot of music that hopefully will be out soon. I'll let you guys know, of course, when, when that happens. So if you'd like to check us out, please, um, you can follow us on Instagram or Facebook. It's at Queen of Peace Band on Instagram and I'll link the video of our thon performance down below if you'd like to check that out as well. So that's a big thing that's been happening in my life um, so it mean the world to me if you go check us out. Another thing, back to the, the Irish thing, another update is um, me and the lead singer of my band who was uh, my friend that I started the band with. We also just recently started our own Celtic duo so around St. Patrick's Day, we had the opportunity to play some Irish music at some local wineries. It went really well, and so we were asked to do more Irish Celtic music around town, and so we've been doing that. So if you'd like to check that out, if you're interested, you can find us on Instagram as well, at Burn and Bridge. Same with Facebook, at Burn and Bridge. And I'll put somewhere in the video what that looks like so you can find it and link it down below as well. I used to post weekly pretty consistently about life was getting really busy with the band and the duo and I've also been dealing with a lot of uh, health problems recently that I've been trying to, to overcome so it's been a little tough. I'm starting to feel a lot better and, and get through it but it's definitely been an interesting couple months for me and it's been it's been tough to it's been tough to to keep going, you know. <laughs> I'm okay and I'm getting better, but it's it's been a journey, you know, trying to figure out band stuff, duo stuff, the guitar stuff, you know, for you guys. It's it's been a lot trying to balance it all as well as take care of myself. But we're better and we're making a vlog right now, so that's good. <laughs> Let me know in the comments what you'd like to see. Sometimes it's hard for me to even like come up with video topics or songs. Do that's a big one. Like when I'm doing cover songs, I'm like, I don't really know what to play, what I'm feeling. Yeah, so that's what's been kind of going on in my life recently. But I will be doing more vlogs and more videos for you guys. Hopefully me and my band or my duo will be doing shows here and there in, in Pennsylvania. So if you live in Pennsylvania and like to come to our show, I'd love to see you. Um, just follow us on Instagram and or follow me on Instagram if you don't already. And um, I'll be posting updates there for live performances. 
but yeah thank you guys so much for always being so supportive of what i do and i i need to be better about posting vlogs you guys have been asking for it for a while but thank you guys for being patient it means the world to me and um yeah let me know what you want me to do in my next vlog because i do like vlogging i just sometimes i don't know what to talk about or or to do so if there's something you'd like to see me do please comment below and give me some ideas Sometimes my brain doesn't work and I need help coming up with things. Please don't hesitate to comment below. Oh, another update. I mean, this kind of came out a while ago, but I don't think I've talked about it on here. I did recently play on my brother's album. He came out with, and I'll link it below or something. He came out with an album called Hymnatize, where he takes church hymns and he remixes them into like EDM songs. And I had the privilege to play on some of those songs, um, specifically the song called Lord of the Dance and Be Not Afraid. Yeah, so if you want to check that out, I did some cool guitar stuff on there and I'll link that below as well or show it up on here if you guys want to check that out. Thank you all for the support. I just thought I'd give you a really quick life update of things that you can, you know, find me on if, um, if you want to see more of what I've been doing recently. And I'll try to update you guys more on here, my journey with, with the band and the duo and, and everything. Yeah, and again, if any of you would like to have any like private lessons from me please reach out to me on instagram just send me a dm thank you so much for all the love and support and i will see you guys in the next video bye